Hello, hello, and welcome to All Your Channel's weekly news cha er, news update for the week of November 3rd through November 9th, November 9th. <laughs> um, before we get into talking about this week's videos, I'd like to quickly thank our wonderful wah, Kofi supporters. I've been working on all sorts of stuff to make, make the OBS and this whole setup look nicer, and I think it looks very good, but um... <laughs> Yeah, I'd like to thank our supporters uh, at the Ato or the Atomic Squid, Candlecorn, Barbara, and Distros. Thank you all very, very much for your support to the channel. Uh, and if you want to become a supporter, follow that link down or it's on the screen right now in the bottom right. Uh, that also appears in the uh, description, top of the description down below, and should be appearing at the end of the video. We'll talk a little bit more about some of the benefits of joining the Kofi later on today. Uh, or later on in the news update, but for now, let's start talking about wow, our calendar, or our, our schedule. Uh, 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 <laughs> there we go. So, as you can see, one of the biggest benefits of the Kofi is visible on screen right now, the start of the Kofi Supporter Chosen Series, Chance of Sonar. Uh, this game was suggested by Distros and voted on by all of you to be the game that I played. Isn't that wonderful? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Um, of course, Distros, uh, now that we're playing your game, you are able to put in a suggestion for a new game that you'd like to, for me to play afterwards, and that is already available on the votes over on the Kofi. Let's quickly go over that to all my supporters. Um... If you support me on the Kofi, every single month there will be votes to help determine what games I play in the future. And once I beat Chance of Snar, I will look at every month's vote. At this point, the October vote has already ended, and the November vote, with Distros' new suggestion, has begun. Uh, so I will look at both October and November, and depending on how long Chance of Snar goes, potentially even December and beyond, and add the total votes across all of those together. To determine what game I play. There's a little bit more factors that go into it, but that's to, uh, on the Kofi if anyone wants to go and look. So if you want to influence what I play in the future, maybe throw me a dollar on Kofi and vote every now and again. Uh, the reason why there's a new vote every month is to reward people who are monthly subscribers rather than just having people quickly hop in and donate one dollar as soon as I beat Chance of Sonar. Uh, additionally, uh, or, or separate from that, if you want to be able to influence what I play on the channel. After we beat Tears of the Kingdom, Death Stranding is going to slide into that slot. And then after we beat Death Stranding, uh, there's a vote on the Discord, also linked down below, that is free to join, where you can uh, vote on any one of hundreds of games that are there that you want to see me play, and you can also give suggestions of games or challenge runs you want to see me do, and then vote for them over there. There's constantly new things being added to that, uh, and actually, in the last week, we added, hang on... What were the games we added to the vote? Yeah, there's already a whole bunch of things in the, in the votes, but we've we've now added Doom Eternal, Full Fathom, Ghostwire Tokyo, and Rain World for all of you to vote on in the uh, free Discord vote. Um. Yeah, now then, with those votes out of the way, let's talk about what actual videos are going up this week. As you can see, for bonus videos, we're going to have uh, Sunless Sea on Sunday, Borderlands with Doodles are on Thursday, and a game dev video on Saturday. Uh, episodes of Chance of Sonar will, and Tears of the Kingdom both go up every single day of the week. And Fallout New Vegas is going up on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday, with Death Stranding going up on Sundays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Uh, once we beat Tears of the Kingdom, both Fallout New Vegas and Death Stranding will be upgraded to be daily series. Uh, now, now let's talk about the specific videos. Bum, bum, bum. So, starting off on Sunday, November 3rd, uh, Sunless Sunday as I like to call it, we start with Chance of the, the first episode of Chance of Sonar, an extra long 36 minute video. And on that note, remember, if a video is more than 30 minutes or less than 20, I'll make note of it here. Otherwise, assume that's the that it's somewhere in that length range. But uh, 
Chance of Snar, the new game we're playing, is a very interesting game in which we find ourselves ascending a tower full of people who speak a language we don't understand, and it's actually a puzzle game where you have to learn and understand that language. Every video going up this we uh... <clears throat> Excuse me. Every video going up this week were all recorded in the first recording session, and actually the second recording session will be happening not too long after this goes up, in only a couple of hours. So, you know, maybe go and check out the, uh, maybe go and hop over to the YouTube channel if you happen to be awake, because this is going up at, like, what, close to midnight, and we'll be streaming at around 3 a.m. I'm in NATO. I stream at 3 a.m. and 3 p.m. Um... But yeah, uh, so if you want to catch a second stream of that, you know, go go hop on over and check that out. After that, we have episode 140 of Death Stranding, making a joke of mules, where we kick some mule ass. Uh, and then we have an extra long episode of Tears of the Kingdom, the 33 minute episode 332, Pimp My Cart, where we attempt to make a sick ass ride for the traveling band. Um, and then we cap off Sunday with episode 55 of Sunless Sea, Exploring the North, where we flesh out our map to the north. Moving on to Monday, November 4th, uh, we have episode 2 of Trance of Sonar, Abbey, where we begin progressing through the narrative and learning a bit more of the language and learning a little bit of the culture of this tower. Uh, then, after that, we have an extra-long episode of Fallout New Vegas, the 31-minute episode 57, Mr. House, where we meet the president, CEO, and sole proprietor of the New Vegas Strip. And then we cap off Monday with episode 333 of Tears of the Kingdom, Battle in the North, another wonderful fight against a uh, camp of monsters alongside the monster control crew, this time in the Frozen North. Moving on to Tuesday, November 5th, we start with episode 3 of Chance of Sonar, Devotee, where we become more uh, ingrained within the faith of the tower. We then have episode 141 of Death Stranding, Cleaning Up Well, where we continue to make excellent progress in getting all of the side quests done in our region. Uh, and then we cap off uh, thir Thursday, I said, right? Tuesday, sorry, I'm mixing up my day. I always mix up my Tuesdays and Thursdays. It's a problem. We cap off Tuesday with episode 334 of Tears of the Kingdom, uh, Kopiki Cave, where we explore a very interesting cave. Uh, we then move on to Wednesday, November 6th, uh, starting off with episode 4 of Chance of Snar, Going Up, where we begin ascending the tower. Uh, we then have the extra-long episode 58 of Fallout New Vegas, Benny, where we finally confront the man we've been looking for all of this time. And then we have episode 335 of Tears of the Kingdom, Hebra Falls, uh, where we take a little bit of a, a sort of a dip, or the opposite of a dip, into the waters of Hebra. Uh, then, on... Thursday, November 7th. Yeah, Thursday. God, I, why do I mix up those two days? Also, can you tell these are unscripted? We have episode 5 of Chance of Sonar, Metal Gear Chance, where we make use of our excellent skill action. Or, or stealth, skill action? Stealth action. Stealth skill. Okay, can you tell these are unscripted? Our excellent stealth skill. I can use words. Uh, we then follow that episode with uh, that. We follow. <laughs> we then follow that up with episode 142 of Death Stranding, Escape from Death Stranding, where we speed on through and avoid something This I don't entirely remember because I recorded this a while ago and the description I wrote for the episode is not very specific, but it's fun. The game is fun. Uh, and then we have episode 336 of Tears of the Kingdom, Sky Giant, where we fight a Sky Giant. And we cap after that. We cap off Thursday with episode 6 of Borderlands with Doodlesar, Catch a Ride! Where we find ourselves a little bit of a ride to move across the barren wastelands of Pandora. Moving on to November 8th, Friday. Uh, we have episode 6 of Chance of Sonar, Learning the Language, where we are really beginning to make some good progress and understand the language around us. 
We then have the extra long 45 minute episode 59 of Fallout New Vegas politics where we have a little bit of political discussion with a very important political figure on the strip. Uh, and then we cap off Friday with episode 337 of Tears of the Kingdom planning ahead where we form plans for what we're doing in the future. Uh, and lastly, we move on to our jam-packed Saturday with loads of videos for you. So let's get into those. First off is episode of episode seven of Chance of Sonar, brute forcing it, where I force my way into understanding in the foreign language. We then have, have episode sixty of Fallout New Vegas, Vault Twenty One. Vault Twenty One. Everything's better when you experience it in a vault. And then we have the extra long episode 143 of Death Stranding, clocking in at 50 or 35, 35 minutes, sorry, uh, kicking ass and delivering packages where we do what it says in the title. After that, we have the extra long episode 338 of Tears of the Kingdom, per picture perfect, where we take the time to get a perfect picture. And we cap things off with, with uh, the 22nd Marble Island Roll game devlog. Uh, smoothed walls clocking in at 39 minutes for an extra long video. Ooh, boy, oh boy, we got a lot of good content coming out, huh? Uh, ew. I really, I love recording content for all of you. <clears throat> Sorry that there is less bonus videos this week than normal. Uh, I haven't been able to get together with my friends because work has been killing me lately. I've been getting uh, fuck tons of hours. I've been working like close to 40 hours, a little over 40 hours a week, somewhere in that ballpark. Uh, and it's really been eating into my streaming time. Um, <clears throat> sorry, I'm, uh, the allergies. I took a leg run, it's still acting up. I have an aller I'm allergic to my wonderful cats. Um, so if I'm, if I find it sound a little stuffed during this whole recording, that's why. But yeah, hopefully I'll be able to find some time to sit down and record more Halo and Grounded and Gary's Mod and Lethal Company and Stardew and all of that with my friends. But you know, we'll see. The bonus series always have the chance to fade in and out. Um, but if you want to help me be able to record not only more of that stuff, but more of other things, I highly recommend you support me on the Kofi. Because right now we just have the one Kofi series, but there's actually a few milestones we can hit that will start more playthroughs on the channel. Uh, the first one, and the one that is the least money overall, but the biggest investment from whoever wants to do it. We have a tier on the Discord for donating $100 a month on the Discord on the Kofi. And I don't really expect anybody to take that tier. But if somebody does, I will reward the person who did it by creating a, a entire additional Kofi playthrough in honor of the person who donates $100. Uh, and if multiple people donate $100 or more, well then it'll be a comp there, there'll be a vote where both of them will get to pick a game and then we'll hold a vote back and forth between the two of them on which one we play. And if it ends up being a tie, uh, uh, I'll work it out there. Uh, but yeah. Uh, that's one way you can get another playthrough on the channel. The second way, this one is much more uh, unrealistic, but uh, anyone, anyone of, or all of you working together could do it, and that is if I am able to make $2,000 a month cumulatively across all collective donations, that'll be enough money that I can comfortably quit my job and dedicate full time to streaming, and if I do that, I will start an additional Kofi supporter found or funded series, which all of you will get to vote on. And then the last one, which I especially don't expect, uh, there's a tier for supporter called Don't, which is, you know, you probably shouldn't donate this much. So the, the 100 level tier was already thrown on as kind of a silly joke, but has the benefits of, oh, you get a playthrough dedicated to just the $100 supporters. And you also will be invited to play games like Lethal Company, Gary's Mod, and Minecraft with me in the future. The don't tier gets all of those benefits, but uh, is also $1,000 a month. And if you support me on that, name a game, I play it. Every don't tier supporter, will be allowed to name one game, 
and I will play that game on the channel, doesn't matter what it is. I will play literally anything, I will find a way to make it work, if you're willing to donate that fucking much money to me. Uh, a lot of these are goals I don't really expect, but hey, they're floating there. And the reason why it's so expensive to get to me to play more games is because I'm already streaming as much as I can, and I'm barely keeping up with the YouTube upload schedule, hence why so many of the bonus videos are gone. Uh, so, you know, if I'm gonna stream more, I'm gonna have to be able to quit my job, and if I'm gonna quit my job, I'm gonna need to be financially stable through this content. Of course, if you don't want to support me on Ko-fi and you want to help me get to that point, another way to do it is to just watch my videos, share them with friends, you know, put a playlist on for your dogs while you go out grocery shopping. Because uh, all of this gets me views, and if I can get to a thousand subscribers, views will equal money, and money will mean financial stability, and I won't have to be two thousand dollars behind on rent. Um. <laughs> but yeah. That's this week's videos. Um, I hope all of you are willing to support me over on the Kofi. Uh, and once again, a wonderful thanks to my wonderful uh, supporters. Uh, again, base tier supporters donating one dollar a month: Atomic Squid, Candle Corn, and Barbara. And our double tier supporter donating ten dollars a month is Distros. Um, oh, also, I don't know if people have seen, there's a new tier in the Kofi, the 1.5 tier, which exists between tier 1 and tier, tier 2, and it has sort of a middle ground of benefits between those. There's a bunch of benefits that I could go over again right here, but, I, yeah, you know what, fuck it. I'm already here recording. Uh, give me a second. Uh-uh-uh, can I get it to... I don't think I got a fancy transition for this, do I? Hang on. Maybe I do. Uh, uh, uh. Give me two seconds. Come on. Oh, eat. Oh, there we go. Yeah, my Kofi. Yeah. So here you go. Here, let's go through the tiers real fast since we're here. So, if you support me for $1 a month, you gain the ability to request games you want to see and partake in votes, as well as uh, get a social media shout out. Again, what we just did now. And you will get a credit in my first game release. Um, also worth note, you can vote in some of the votes even if you aren't a monthly supporter by just going and throwing a dollar at me. You could go and partake in the November vote right now. You don't even need to become a monthly subscriber. Uh, at $5, you're a 1.5 sub tier subscriber, and at that point, you will get a 5x5 five five sprite in your honor, uh, a weekly, or, and, you know, or that, 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 a 5x5 five five sprite in your honor appearing in the weekly shout-out, like how Distros has the 10x10 10 10 sprite right there. Uh, you will get to request games you want to see me play and partake in the votes, and you will get uh, access to the special uh, Heart of Action content that I post. Um, then double tier supporter gets all the previous benefits, their sprite is upgraded from a 5x5 five by five by, to a 10x10, 10 10, and they get a second vote on all major votes. Anytime I create a poll, a second version of every poll is made, uh, in, like, for, just for the double tier supporters. Now, these are all the tiers I kind of expect you guys to be willing to go into, you know? Like, like... These are reasonable. This is the unreasonable stuff. The stuff I don't expect people to donate. So, at the triple tier supporter for donating $30, you get a 20 by 20 sprite in your honor. Triple the votes, so there'll be a third vote made just for triple tier supporters. Uh, all the previous benefits, but also a chance to design your own character to have appear in episode an episode of Shadow Space. Uh, you will be able to create a character who will be a sort of side, one-off, bit fun character who I will I will play out for the players to interact with and meet in Shadow Space. You can stipulate what kind of personality they have, maybe have them give the players a quest, you know, something like that, if you enjoy the Shadow Space series. Oh, which, by the way, I forgot to mention, 
reason there's no shadow space this week is it is a tri-weekly series rather than bi-weekly. We've reduced how often it goes up because of how long the episodes are. So once a month now, more or less. So it should be go. There should be an episode of shadow space next week. Then we have the solid gold tier. By donating hundred dollars, you'll get four votes on every single vote. Uh, you'll get a forty by forty sprite. Access to everything else, the unique gold supporter votes, and get, be able to make a suggestion for gold supporter votes. That you know, that's a one hundred dollar playthrough, the go solid gold one hundred dollar playthrough. Um, and you will also have the chance to join me in live streams of certain games like Gary's Mod and Lethal Company. Yeah. And then there's the don't tier, which I I put mainly has a joking reference to one of my favorite YouTubers over analyzing Avatar. They get access to all of the previous benefits, an 80 by 80 sprite uh, representing them, so we're getting really detailed here. Um, and there will be a whole additional, you will get to just pick a game and I will play that game. And also you get a fifth vote on everything, that on all the uh, supporter votes. So yeah. Uh, well, there, there's a lot. A lot of benefits. Yeah, thank you all so much for, you know, watching my content, sitting through these long-ass meandering news updates, and just for being here. Love all you very, very much, and I'll see you all next video. Ta-ta!